It's an educational adventure waiting for the littles at the Grand Rapids Public Museum. A new exhibit called Building Buddies has kids thinking like engineers with a heavy focus on science, tech, engineering, arts, and math. Kelly Rosecrans has all the details. She's joining us this morning to tell us all about it. Hi, Kelly. Hi, how are you? I'm well. Thanks for being here. Thanks for having me. I appreciate it. Tell us about Building Buddies. It's been out for a couple weeks now. So yeah. how does it line up with the museum's mission? Yeah, Building Buddies is really for ages kids 2 to 8. Okay. It's really in that sweet spot of the, the young elementary school and toddler age. And, uh, you know, for the past couple weeks that it's been open, it opened January 20th. Okay. We've really been seeing the kids enjoy it. They've got plenty of space to roam around and, and kind of break free and, and play on their own and it's really those science technology arts engineering and math skills like you mentioned mm -hmm. that they're practicing and they're also working together to build community uh, the whole exhibit is centered around building a community with different individuals that make up a, a unique community and they get to be a part of that and so what type of learning outcomes are we aiming for here yeah we're really working on those science skills and process so really putting together those pipes or laying squares together to create a pattern so really those science skills and, and a little bit of creativity, okay. but also working together. I like that. Uh, uh, this sounds perfect for school groups. Oh my gosh, I mean, because yes. I mean, you talk about science, and I mean, these, yes. are, these are subjects that they teach. Yes, we are. We have a lot of school groups booked in already, and we're, we're open to more. So if any, any you know, school teachers or administrators out there are listening, yeah. um, we encourage them to contact us at the GRPM. Um, and our group scheduling team can book field trips or small group visits, um, classroom visits, and... Um, We've, we had some kids in there yesterday from <laughs> Granville Public Schools, Perfect. and it was really fun to watch them, you know, interact with each other, but also with the exhibit itself and, and have fun while they're learning. And so let's, let's dive into the exhibit a little bit more. Yeah. I mean, am I putting a hard hat on here? I mean, it's, we have it, hard hats. it's like construction <laughs> we site, We do, right? yeah. We have little hard hats and, and construction vests for the kids, totally optional, but it's funny, you know, you watch the kids come in and they just gravitate toward it. They go grab them on their own. We got to have the look. Yes. Right? <laughs> Look the part. Look the part. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> How long is this going to be at the museum? We have it for a while. So okay. all through the summer, we have it until September 1st. Okay. So lots of time for school groups or families to come out and enjoy it. And through the summer. I must ask uh, about how this ties into, I mean, you're doing a lot of construction. I mean, yes. you're, 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 there's a big project happening at the Absolutely. museum right now. Absolutely. Yeah. We're so excited about our expansion and a lot of our expansion centers around expanding our educational resources, having the space to expand those resources. And, you know, while we have the ground dug up and there's heavy machinery on the, the property and we're, we're working on, you know, making our riverfront more accessible. Not, not, not to cut you short, but this might be a real life example of what, oh my gosh, I mean, yeah. there's construction happening exactly. right there. <laughs> and, and, you know, the kids can feel a part of that and families can feel a part of, you know, building that community that we're aiming to build through this expansion. Yeah, it's so neat and what you're doing. And for those who don't know really quickly what yeah. that expansion entails yep. and how long that's going to go because I know the carousel is closed. Correct. Right? The yep, right. the carousel is closed um, temporarily, but for a, a long while here. And mm -hmm. the reason for that is that we are working to separate. Right now, the carousel goes through, you know, an interior pathway, yeah. and we're working to separate that so that that greenway can go through and it's more accessible to everyone to get straight through that space outside the museum along the river and it really connects to multiple paths throughout Cat County. Can't wait to see the finished mm -hmm. product. I mean the renderings are pretty impressive. So We're excited about it. Grand Rapids Public Museum now through September if you've got a little engineer in your house or somebody who just loves those Legos or you know, mm -hmm. wants to put things together, construction, building buddies is going to dive into that. Science, tech, engineering, arts and math, it's all included. Go to grpm.org for more information.